date polo back to about 500 BC. It is the oldest team sport in the world. All right, our teams are making their way over to this side of the field. I'm going to turn the microphone over here. For the team in blue, the Galaxy Home Solutions team, in the number one is going to be Miguel Lise Planos. Playing in the number two, Roberto Navaja. Playing in the number three is going to be Horacio Lasasso. And playing the anchor today, Mr. Francisco Yosa. All right, now for the Ardens team in the white jerseys today. In the number one is going to be Ava Hinkson. In the number two, Paige Boone. And in the number three is going to be the baby face himself, Nick Johnson. And playing the anchor today, Francisco Bill Bow. Our two umpires are Christian Vasquez and Ronnie Hayes be a live ball. Six chuckers to decide who's going to be the winner and pick up that $2,500 check. The first ball is in play. This is Horatio waiting for everyone to clear out of the way. Horatio now looking, looking, trying to see where all his players are. Goes with a nice deep neck shot. Puts it up there for one of his teammates to go get, but the only one there right now is going to be Nick Johnson with a tail shot back over here near the pavilion. But now it's going to be Horacio, the first one to get onto that loose ball. Horacio, Lasasso, taps it once, taps it twice. Ava comes in, puts a little pressure on him. Now Roberto comes in to help out. But Horacio still with the ball, looking at the goal, trying to increase their lead, add to that handicap. He takes a shot towards the goal, but Bill Bow is right there. But following up the play is going to be Francisco Josa. Puts it between the uprights. After every single goal, they switch ends. That way neither team has any advantage or disadvantage throughout the match. All right, so Galaxy is going to be going towards the scoreboard. But Paige Boone with a nice back shot. Now Yosa backs it. Here comes Nick Johnson. Nick. Waiting for the right moment. Doing a little cat and mouse game right now. Waiting, waiting. Now he's going to put a pass up to Boone. Paige Boone out on a fast horse. And now this one is put out in front of the goal. But here comes Roberto Navaja. But Ava's there on the near side. And then Paige Boone's right there. Oh, she can't make contact. And now Yosa. Yosa. Francisco Yosa's right there. Yosa now trying to get this one out in the open area. But here comes his, his friend. His roommate, Nick Johnson, with the back shot. And it goes right over to Bill Bow. Francisco Bill Bow. Ardens is looking to get on the board quickly. And Francisco Bill Bow gives Ardens their first tally of the match. Now the score, three to one. That goal by Bill Bow. Ball gets put back into play. Johnson gets a mallet on it. Oh, it pops back out. Two players coming in to give Bill Bow a hard time. They may have had a foul there, but they play advantage. And now what a pass by Nick Johnson. Tries to get it up there to Ava. Ava comes in, but right there was Horacio with the back shot. It's going to go over there, and now Paige Boone with a back shot. And stopping on that ball is going to be Bill Bow. Francisco Bill Bow. Tapping it once, tapping it twice. Roberto Navaja comes in, puts the pressure on him. And now look at Bill Bow. He takes a shot on goal. It's rolling, rolling, rolling. And backed out of danger by Horacio. And now here comes Nick Johnson. Nick is right there. He's trying to tap this one through the goal. And just like that, that's goal number two for Arden's Fine Jewelers. Nick. 30 left in chucker number one. We play six chuckers. Chucker is a period in the sport of polo. Ava, Ava coming through. But right here comes Horacio Lasasso out of that throw in. Tapping it once. He's just trying to gain control in possession and let all the white players go right by or the white jersey players. All right, here comes Horacio, not able to get around, and now here comes Ava, but she gets hooked off the play right there by Francisco Josa. Josa. And now it's sitting right there. Here comes Miguel. He leads it for teammate Horacio. Horacio now 
Taps it towards the goal. Horacio cuts it towards the goal. What a cut shot, but puts a little too much on it. And this one goes wide right. One and a half. One minute, 30 seconds left here in our first chucker. Two to three is a score. Here we're going to have a horse race possibly. Here comes Nick. He tells Ava to leave it, and now Nick Johnson is off to the races, and Francisco Joseph is trying to chase him down, but Nick Johnson has a fast horse. Can he go to the near side? Nick, baby face, Johnson, but there was a whistle. Wh Team Ardens receives possession of the ball at midfield now for a penalty five, and this is going to be Francisco Bilbao. He fakes the big hit. He's got players going left. He's got players going right. Now he puts the ball over to the right-hand side, and he's got Paige Boone out there in the open. Yosik comes through, tries to get a hook on the mallet, not able to, and here comes Paige. Paige takes a shot. It ricochets off the goalpost, and Nick Johnson is right there to put it in between the uprights. And just Hey, Lordy, are you third man? Okay, thanks. Make sure you don't move any of our chairs around downstairs. Due to COVID, we have to keep the chairs socially distancing from each other, and they are placed in certain areas. All right, here we go, back in action. A little bit of a sandwich right there, but let's see what our umpires decide. This is going to be a penalty for... All right, sitting right there. It's going to be Francisco Josa. Josa with the ball. Crosses over midfield. And he's going to try to get in between those two white players. And now, whistle sounds on the field. Francisco Josa puts it in between the uprights. So we have a tie score. Back to the throw-in we come, and switching ends once again. The ball goes all the way through the throw-in, and it's going to be Francisco Bilbao. Bilbao, he's going to put that pony into high gear, and now he's going up the field. The ball kind of goes off the heel of his mallet, and it goes up against the boards right there. And he pulls it back away from the boards, and now he's got a little run on the goal. Here comes Nick Johnson. Nick, he's got Joseph right there. Nick shoots. It's deflected. He hits it again. And this one went wide of the goal. A lot of procedures that these umpires are telling the players they need to follow. And this is what happens when you start to get some money on the line. Here we go with a knock-in. Here comes Horacio Lasasso. Lasasso waiting for the right moment. Taps it, it bounces off a pony's foot. Now he comes across the field. Here comes Lasasso, here comes Boone. There's a horse race, they're letting those ponies stretch out. Lasasso's is a little bit quicker. He goes to the near side, that ball's going. Here comes Boone, can Paige get there? She backs it out of the goal in the nick of time. What a play that was. Wow, finally you all woke up downstairs. All right, here we go, and on the tailgating side as well. Here comes Nick Johnson back the other way. He flips it back to Bilbao, Francisco Bilbao. He's trying to get around Roberto Navaja, and now we're coming right back the other way just as fast as we went the opposite way. Bilbao lofts it up over there. He waits for it to settle down, goes with a shot. Can he get there before it goes off the end? Uh, yes, he can. He shoots, but this one goes just wide of the goal runs unless the umpires blow the whistle or it goes to zero. Here comes Francisco Yosa off the end line. Horacio just changed horses so he's on a fresh set of legs and now Yosa puts this one out a little too far in front of him and it allows Paige Boone to come in with the back shot. Nicely done right there. Now Nick Johnson comes in, pulls it off the boards. He's got Bill Bow going towards goal. Can he get it to him? Navaja's right there and now it's going to be backed by Horacio back over near the boards. And now here comes Joseph. Whistle. Team blue jersey. Here comes Francisco Joseph. Joseph. Goes with the big hit. Trying to get it up there to Miguel. Miguel can't wait any longer. 
And the whistle sounds. Two minutes, 58 seconds. Here comes Bill Bow. He puts it out there, then he takes off. He leaves it for Nick, and Nick lofts it up over everyone's head. Right back to Bill Bow, give and go. And now we have another horse race. I told you you were going to be in store for some good polo. Look at those players pumping, pumping, pumping. Whistle, whistle. We're at 241. 241. Here comes Horatio. Horatio with the ball. Roberto's off the field right now, changing horses. So the team in blue is down one player. And now, just sitting right there. And this is going to be Francisco Josa. Josa. He's got Francisco Bilbao right there. And so we'll throw the ball back into play with two minutes and 19 seconds. Who's going to win this throw in? Here comes Bill Bow. He puts it out of there. And Nick Johnson was out in the open space. Here comes Nick. Nick Johnson, he's over there in Coffin Corner. But now he slows it down and angles it back towards the goal, picks it up on the bounce. Nick Johnson, but here comes Yosa. In front of the goal, he puts the pressure on, but it goes in between the uprights for goal number five. Nick. 120. One minute, 20 seconds. 120. And ball's back in play. It's going to be picked up there by Roberto Navaja. Roberto Navaja taking this one up the field. And now he's hooked off the play, but right there's Francisco Josa. And now a little flip shot. Nick Johnson with a near side back shot. The near side's the left side of the pony. The off side's the right side of the pony. And now we're coming up the field. Here comes Paige Boone. We got two white jerseys out here and no blue jerseys. She puts it way out there. And now Francisco Bilbao taking this one up the field. He can be able to walk this one through the goalpost. Francisco Bilbao puts it in between the uprights for goal. All right. Horacio gets a mallet on it. Nick's horse gets out of the way. And now Ava comes in and hooks Miguel's mallet. And now Nick is going to back it right over here in front of the pavilion. Umpire calls play. And this is going to be Horatio trying to catch Arden's on their heels. Horatio, but Nick Johnson's right there with a little flip shot. Out of danger. Here comes Francisco Joseph running the spin. I believe there was a whistle. Maybe not. Now Joseph takes a shot on goal, doesn't connect, and this one goes wide right. This is going to be a knock-in for Team Ardens. You see our flaggers on each end. When that ball goes through the goal, they wave it high. When it does not go through, they wave it low. Here comes Nick Johnson. He puts a shot up the field, trying to get it up to one of his teammates. And this is going to be Horacio, Horacio Lasasso. Lasasso with the ball, tapping it once, tapping it twice. Leaves it there for teammate Josa. Francisco Josa now goes with a nice shot over near the middle of the goal, and it's going to be picked up there by Roberto Navaja with a shot on goal. And Nick is going to escort that ball off the field, so we'll have another knock in for Team Ardens. Francisco Bilbao. Coming up the field, here he comes. He's got Yosa on his hip. He puts a shot across the field. Look at this pinpoint accuracy pass. And here comes Boone. Here comes Miguel. They neutralize each other. Now Navaja takes the ball forward. And now here comes Navaja. But Ava's right there. Ava comes in, puts a bump on Navaja, doesn't let him hit the ball. And now. Here comes Nick Johnson. Nick trying to zig and zag through all the players. It's sitting right there. Now it's going to be Francisco Bilbao closing in on another goal. 
gets bumped, and now Nick Johnson has possession. Nick gets a whistle in the goal mouth. Four minutes, seven seconds? 4.07, four, oh four minutes and seven seconds. Here comes Francisco Bilbao. Puts a nice long shot up the field, trying to get it to Paige Boone, but it's going to be picked up by Navaja. And now Nick stabs it out of the air. He goes for the back shot back towards the center of the field. Not able to get enough on it. Now it's going to be picked up by Horacio Lasasso. He gets hooked off the play by Nick Johnson. And a whistle sounds. Wake up, everybody. Shoulder to shoulder and going the same speed. Here comes Francisco Josa. Josa waiting for the right moment. Now he's going he shoots, and this one's going to go wide right. You know, he's got 20 seconds to hit this knock-in once three. the umpire says play. Three minutes, three minutes. Now he goes across the field trying to get it to Paige Boone. She goes to the near side. Doesn't make contact because right there was Roberto Navaja. Now here comes Francisco Josa. A little cat and mouse game between him and Nick Johnson, and Joseph wins this one. Oh, but he overrides it right there, and here comes Navaja. Roberto Navaja coming down the line of the ball. And now he passes over to Horacio. They're right there about the 60-yard line. He takes a shot on goal, doesn't get a lot on it. And now Francisco Bilbao clearing it out of danger for Team Ardens. Coming across by you tailgaters over there. And now it's up against the boards. And let me see what they're going to do. A little flip back shot. Back to Paige Boone. And now Paige Boone has possession. Paige Boone taking this one up the field. Lofts it up over everyone's head and she jumps back on the line. Here comes Paige Boone with a nice long shot up the field. She has an opportunity to carry this ball all the way to the goal. And now she's going to take a swing and shoots just wide right. Five seconds, 135. Francisco Joseph brings the ball in off the end line. Goes with a nice long shot up the field, trying to get it to Roberto Navaja. Navaja's right there, but Ava's going to try to chase him down. Here comes Navaja. It pops up in the air, but Miguel is right there. He gets hooked off the play. And here's Bill Bow. He plays the ball forward. Francisco Bill Bow now. He's got Yosa. And he lofts it up over, and it goes up over the boards, just like I told you earlier. Don't throw that back out on the field. That is a souvenir. Keep it. Zero left here in chucker number three. Whistle sounds. Not touch the field until it's hit. And now it's hit, and it goes up, up in the air. And that's what Galaxy needed, because now they slowed down momentum a little bit. That's goal number five, and there's 36 seconds. Three seconds. Make sure you visit Final Chucker and Almost Famous Larry. I saw a little handicap over here because they don't have any golf carts to blow the horns. But here we go, Chucker number four. And right out of that throw-in, we'll see if any of the strategies may have been changed up here in the second half. Here comes a little flip back shot by Horacio back to his teammates. Here comes Miguel across the field. A lot of players riding gray horses, this Chucker. And now it's going to be... Francisco Josa on one of his favorite gray horses right there. It's almost white. And now he gets bumped off the play by Nick Johnson, but Horacio's right there. Horacio Lasasso taps it once, taps it twice. And now it's going to be Horacio with a shot on goal, but it's going to go a little wide right. At five. So we'll have a knock-in. Nice long shot up the field to Paige Boone. She puts her gray pony in the high gear. And now this one's up a little bit further. And now Miguel with the back shot. And now it's going to be picked up by Francisco Josa. Josa with the back shot over to Lasasso. Lasasso with the ball. Goes with a little lofted shot up over everyone's head right over to Francisco Joseph. He gets hooked off the play by Nick Johnson. And now Nick with a neck shot up the field. And here comes Bill Bow on a fast little bay pony. Francisco Bill Bow just bypassed two blue jerseys. And now he's going to take a shot on goal. And just like that, 
in between the uprights for goal number eight. What a play by Francisco Bilbao. The champion of United Healthcare Weekend. Take home the big check. All right, ball's back in play. This is Bill Bow coming out of that throw in on that nice horse. He is off to the races once again. Oh, he doesn't make contact, but right there's Paige Boone following up the play. She goes to the near side, to the offside, has that ball going right there in the goal mouth. Horacio takes it off the end line. What a save, but gets whistled right there for turning the ball back up the field in front of the white jersey that had the right of way. He said that he didn't see a foul, so this is going to be a throw-in, and it's going to be won by Bill Bow. Francisco Bill Bow puts his shot up the field, but it's deflected off a pony, and now it's going to be Francisco Josa. Page comes in, tries to steal it away, gets a mallet on it, and now here comes Josa. And now it's going to be picked up there by... there where the whistle sounded and here we go eight to five is our score and out of the backside of that throw and it's Paige Boone Boone with a nice shot forward riding a nice little gray pony Paige Boone takes a shot on goal puts it right up there in the goal mouth and now she takes the next shot towards the goal and that one goes wide right and and now bringing it off the end line it's gonna be Francisco Josa Josa zigging and zagging can't pick it up off the bounce, though. He's waiting, but it's going to be a back shot by Bill Bow. Trying to get over there, Nick Johnson. Nick takes a shot on goal, and it goes wide right. In the marathon, Chucker. But everything is good because we want to make sure safety force and former. Oh, Horacio loses control right there. Bill Bow tries to come in, not able to get control of the ball. Now here comes Horacio. Lasasso coming up the field at a fast rate of pace. And now he comes through. He bypasses everybody on the field. And this one goes off the heel of his mallet. But right there is Roberto Navaja to put the pass right back to him. And Horacio with an opportunity, driving for show and putting for dough. What a and You hear the umpire counting down. They have 25 seconds to get back to the throw in once the goal is scored. And now back shot by Horacio, but no one's out there. But here comes Paige Boone. She just switched horses. She's coming over here in front of the pavilion. You guys all awake downstairs? Time to cheer them on as they go by. Paige Boone, nicely done, goes to the offside, to the near side, and to the near side once again. And now she's on the offside, and now she gets a cut shot towards the goal. It's going to be Paige Boone! Oh, she got a new mallet. See a lot of players. Page actually went and get a new mallet. Now to this throw in, it's Navaja. Roberto Navaja coming towards the goal. Navaja with a nice cut shot. 30 seconds. 30 seconds left. Navaja doesn't make contact. And now it's going to be Paige Boone clearing it out of danger. She's over there along the boards, way over there on that far side. And now a next shot up the field right there, and it's going to be picked up by Bill Bow on the near side. Paige Boone following up the play right there, digs it off the boards with a nice long shot up the field. And now it's going to be Francisco Bill Bow. That's it. The final horn of the chucker right there sounds with the score, 9-6. to six. Before we go... Dancing in the dark, dancing there. I knew I'd need my sunglasses. So we're going to start this chucker right where that one ended. Team Ardens will have the short end of the field by about 50 yards. All right, the ball's back in action. Coming out of that throw in, it's Horacio. But a little flip of the ball right there by Bill Bow. And now here comes Nick Johnson. Nick trying to get it off the boards right there. Probably getting a couple brownies from 
his fan club over there. And now he puts it up over everyone's head. And now it's going to be intercepted there. And here comes Lasasso. Lasasso puts a nice long shot up the field, trying to get it to Roberto Navaja. Navaja avoids the hook there from Boone. Navaja trying to get another shot. But this time, no, it's still rolling, and Navaja gets another oh, shot nice. towards the goal. What a shot by Roberto, puts it in the goal mouth, and cleared out of danger by Paige Boone. Boone coming across the field now. Gets another mallet on it, goes to the near side, but this time she gets hooked. No, it's still rolling forward. Who's going to be the next player in line? Somebody in blue. It's going to be Francisco Josa. Josa now with the ball, trying to zig and zag through all those white jerseys. Francisco, Josa, cat and mouse game going on. But once again, Paige Boone clearing it out of danger. Coming across the field right over here in front of the VIP section. And Nick Johnson jumps in on the line. Here comes Nick Johnson. Puts a nice long shot up the field. Nick and Josa come together. They're bumping. They're riding. And now it's going to be Francisco Josa. Oh, he overrides the ball. And now it's going to be a stop on the dime right there by Lasasso. Lasasso now trying to see where his teammates are. He puts a pass over to Josa. Francisco Josa trying to get around Francisco Bilbao. But he put the ball right there. And now it's going to be the thief in the night going the opposite direction. And now once again, this trucker has been wide open already. And now, and now Lasasso puts the pony in high gear. Trying to get this one up there in between the uprights. And Horacio Lasasso puts it in for goal number seven. And ball's back in play. Out of that throw in, it's Navaja. Roberto Navaja coming out of that throw in with the ball. Navaja. Can't get around Nick Johnson. Now Nick Johnson turns the spin. Here comes Nick the other way. He leaves it there for Ava. And now it's going to be left there for Paige Boone. And this one deflects off a pony. But right there is Bill Bow. Francisco Bill Bow right there. Waiting for the right moment to release the ball up to one of his teammates. And now it's going to be intercepted there by Josa. Three. three minutes, three minutes left here in the fifth chucker. Nine to seven is our score. Nick Johnson with a back shot. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Whistle sound. Can put it over their heads. Line drives it and everyone's ducking out of the way. It went in. So Francisco Bilbao converts the penalty four for goal number. Ball bounces out, and it's going to be picked up there by Francisco Bilbao. Bilbao now with a nice shot up the field, trying to get it up there close to the goal. And now I got a major glare looking that direction. <laughs> and this is going to be Boone chasing down Francisco Josa. And now this is going to be Nick Johnson. Nick. Gets hooked off the play there by Horacio. The ball's sitting right there. And now Yosa with the back shot doesn't get enough on it. Now Boone with the back shot. And it's going to be picked up there by Bill Bow. But the two blue jerseys come together right there. Lasasso, one minute, 30 seconds. Horacio with a nice pass over to Roberto Navaja. He puts it out there. But no one's out there to receive the pass. And here comes Bill Bow. Takes a calculated risk going across the goal. The whistle. Francisco Josa. Wide right. Opportunities missed. And now one minute. One minute left here in the frantic fifth. And now Bill Bow puts a nice pass right out there to Boone. And now here comes Roberto Navaja. She play, he plays it forward and backs it. It's knocked down. And here comes Paige Boone. Boone reaches down. She's in control of the ball. 
And now Boone's going up the field with a nice shot up the field, but she gets ridden off the play. But 30 seconds, 30 seconds, Bill Bow shoots. And Yosa's going to clear it out of the goal mouth. Francisco Yosa. Oh, he rides over top of it, but right there is going to be. I believe that's Navaja taking the ball forward. And now it's going to be the clock ticking down. We had the 30-second horn. Five seconds. That's the final horn. The ball is on the playing field. The final horn sounded of a frantic fifth right there with the score 10-7. Fun fact, this is from Brooks Jefferson, Garth Brooks, and Spotify. And who's going to take home that big check? All right, the ball's back in action. I'm looking directly into the sun. And coming out with it's going to be Horacio. Horacio's got Nick on his hip. Now Nick Johnson comes through. Horacio comes through. His pony kicks it forward, but he can't get back to it quickly enough. And now it's going to be Nick Johnson. Nick, little nine iron lofted shot up over everyone's head. Bill Bow waits for it to settle down. Comes in, taps it behind Roberto, takes a shot on goal. It reaches Boone's mallet. And now Paige from the near side. Now Francisco Bilbao puts goal number 11 on the board. Thank All right, teams go back to the middle of the field. Out of that throw, and this is what Galaxy needed. Here comes Horacio. Horacio out of that throw, and he's on a fast pony. Horacio Lasasso, just like that, puts goal number eight on the board. So, and put goal number nine on the board. It bounces out right to Bilbao's mallet. Francisco Bilbao now controls the ball. And now he's trying to get around all those blue jerseys. Roberto Navaja is right there. Miguel Liz Plenos is right there. And now Bill Bow still with the ball, tapping it up the field. Waiting, waiting. He's trying to get this ball up there. He overrides it right there. It's going to be Nick Johnson coming through. I believe we had a whistle. Whistle. I think they just waited for one of the players, may have dropped something, I'm not sure, but here we come back the other way. Here comes Lasasso. Horacio. Oh, he doesn't, he gets underneath that one, but no one was there waiting. So he's able to stop and turn and get back to it without losing control. Now he reaches back, puts the ball out in front of him a little bit. Him and Bill Bow come together, neutralizing each other, but now here comes Yosa, Francisco Yosa on the near side. Tries to avoid the hook from Nick Johnson. Now he taps it. Nick comes in and steals it away. Nick Johnson. And now Bill Yosa out of the air backs it. And now here comes Roberto with a little back shot back towards the middle of the field. But it's going to be intercepted there by Bill Bow, who puts a long shot up there. And the only person out there is Nick Babyface Johnson with an opportunity to put goal number 12 on the board. His horse is a little anarchy right there, but he's able to walk the ball through the goal post for goal number 12 for Arden's Fine Jewelers. Three minutes, 10 seconds, 310. Yosa wins this throw in. Now he puts it up there to his teammate right to Horacio. What a good give and go. Lasasso puts it between the uprights. They still have. With a penalty one and some help from the Polo Gods, they might have an opportunity. But they have to win this throw in. But Nick Johnson takes the ball out of the throw in and he puts the pass out there to Francisco Bilbao. And he's being chased down by Roberto Navaja. Oh, and now Navaja takes this ball forward. Still on the field of play. He's going to have to run 300 yards. And now he gets it past Nick Johnson. He leaves it there for Yosa. 
And now he puts a pass up there, and it's going to be picked up by Horacio Lasasso with another opportunity. He is off to the races. Oh, this one pops up in the air. Miguel is right there. Miguel gets a mallet on it, but Ava's right there putting the pressure on him. And now here comes Paige Boone with the back shot, but it's going to be intercepted right there and shot back towards the goal. It's rolling towards the goal and just makes it over the end line right there, but what a run right there. We're down two. Couple players taking this opportunity to change horses, and Paige Boone takes the knock in. Boone brings it in off the end line, puts a pass up there to Nick Johnson. Nick now, a little give and go possibly right here, puts a Whoa. nine iron. He was out on the golf course yesterday, and now he puts this one up here, and now it's gonna be picked up by Nick Johnson. Nick. Takes the ball forward and puts it up there. And now it's going to be Horacio Lasasso. Lasasso with the ball. Now he's coming back the other direction. Here we come. Coming up on 30. 30. That's the 32nd horn right there. And now Horacio gets a mallet on it. And now Bill Bowles just going to. It's formality, let the clock run out right here. You can see some of the players shaking hands already. But we'll hear the horn here in just a second. All right, go ahead. That's the final horn, the score. What a match today for the United Healthcare eight goal. Give a round of applause to our two umpires, Christian and Ronnie. Thank you. I believe our best playing ponies making its way up here as well. But what an afternoon of polo. Both of the teams are now on the podium. So let's give another round of applause. What a match today. The United Healthcare eight goal weekend. Our first weekend of real competitive polo. And our two teams won on Friday and made their way to the finals today. A hard fought match that was won by the Arden's Fine Jewelers. What a match. We want to do the pony real quick. We'll be on, we'll do trophies and do pony. There you go. All right. Our best playing pony was played in the fourth chucker by Francisco Bilbao. Polo coming up here with the pony right here. What's the name of this pony? Victoria. How old is she? Eight years old. Frank, where, yeah, fourth chucker. Where'd she come from, Frankie? Came from Argentina. Oh, she's talking. Bring her in here. Let's give that pony a gorgeous looking pony. He made two runs on this pony up and down the field. He's going to get a good photo. Talking to everybody. All right. Well done. Good job, my friend. The pony's gonna go back. Leave us a little present right here, but we go back to the stable now. All right. Now for our runners up today, Team Galaxy playing in the number one was Miguel Lee Planos. Playing in the number two, Roberto Navaja. Playing in the number three was Horacio Lasasso. And playing the anchor today, Francisco Josa. We're gonna get them a picture real quick.
then we got to hand out this big check we got from the USPA. But first we'll do our MVP today. It was a hard decision to come up with MVP, but he scored four goals in the second half to try to bring his team back. Horacio Lasasso was all over the field today. Played very well all weekend. But today he came out and was trying his hardest. Trying to stay up on top of the game, but just got out of hand a little bit and couldn't keep up with those three, four players for Ardens. Yeah. <laughs> but what a match. And an MVP. All right, now we got to hand out this big trophy. Oh, yeah, he probably got pants ripped. Do you want... This is a USPA trophy that we're going to hand out a big old check right here. So, uh, the, yeah, make sure we abide by all the rules and regulations of COVID-19 and the health department. Yeah, this check right here for $2,500 going to Arden's Fine Jewelers. What a match, and they get the check right there. Once again, thank you all for coming out. Next weekend, we have the Villages Insurance 8 Goal. It'll be Friday at 3 o'clock and Sunday at 1. Make sure you mark your calendars. It's been a great day. I believe Tara Del Sol is still serving up some cold drinks, and they may have some food at the concession as well. But thank you all for coming out. Make sure you mark your calendars. Make sure you get your tickets online or at the box office because they do sell out with our limited seating capacity. And we will see you all next week.